although um, some horror games pull it off, kind of. Can I save? No, I can't save. I guess this is a checkpoint though, right? Okay, so um, I'm actually done for now. I will be back with the rest of this game. Subscribe if you want. Don't subscribe if you don't. Um, I would appreciate it, but honestly, I, I'm not making money off this channel, so I'm not going to sit here and, and ask for people to subscribe. Peace, everybody. Apparently, I, I, my mistake, I was wrong before in the previous video. Um, I was thinking of the first game. This one actually came out in 2021, which makes it weirdly like one of the most recent games I've actually played. Because <laughs> normally I'm, I'm like so many years behind on my backlog that I just assume every game is like 10 years old. Not that 2027 was 10 years ago, but yeah, almost. <sighs> Jesus, it's almost already March 2023. Is this normal that they hang people from TVs or what's going on? There's a lot of suicide in uh, these these two games, I, or at least it looks that way. Like uh, there were a lot of dudes that hung themselves in the mob. Oh wow, this is like actually well, duh. I mean, it's, it's a town. This is way different. Just the mood it feels a lot different than the original game. I mean, in the mod, it was all claustrophobic and kind of evil. <laughs> but most of this just seems to be abandoned and creepy. I'm up here. They did the same thing in the original. They had the, or in the first, they had these misleading chairs that you could climb on, but they didn't actually let you go anywhere. Or era appropriate TVs. for some like idiotic reason I was like oh that that hole's no big deal okay I wasn't thinking this is what the problem was I tried to jump on the TV when that's not the deal here well how's she gonna get up here Um, the one thing I noticed, I don't know if this will be an added mechanic later or what, you don't have the lighter like in the first game, so it's... I mean... Another thing is the environments like aren't as dark.
And it would be cool to, to have some sort of a torch. I never actually played it, but this kind of gives me more of a of a brother's vibe than a little nightmare's vibe. Oh, that's not even gonna cut that out. <laughs> that was clearly a horrible attempt. Where am I? Uh, bro, I cannot make that jump. Especially with the camera right back here. Are you hating me? Okay, just gotta gotta get good is the problem. She can't. Does this game have co-op? I'm, I'm doubting that it does. What's this little specter about? I apologize for talking constantly. <laughs> but then, I mean, I don't know why people are watching these to begin with. Uh, I assume you can watch gameplay footage everywhere. Anywhere. Don't fall. Okay. The camera changed. Just <laughs> thought I was falling. Another, yeah, yet another noose without even a dude. Just close. What did he like turn straight into a ghost and his clothes stayed there? Poltergeist shit. It's just the hallway. What? I was doing it wrong. Oh, okay. So this is the symbol from the law. I wonder if maybe this character escaped from the maw. Uh, to be honest, again, I didn't play the DLC, so it's totally possible this is like the other kid from the DLC.
So there's a, like a Raven Academy, or I, I don't know really anything about the original game. I played it through like twice and. On the other side, do you know how to seesaw? <sighs> you suck. <laughs> it's got to be an achievement for playing with this crap too. Like making a goal, a basket. There's no basketball hoop. Well, this school sucks. I'm over here trying to, to press uh, left bumper to run like it's dead space. <laughs> what happens when you play one game primarily? She looks the woman in the photo looks slightly less creepy than most of the humans in this universe so far. The, the geisha, whatever, the hostess. Oh, okay, yeah, they've, they're psychotic. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, what do I. What happens if I stand here? I feel like by now there should be a ton of collectibles. I'm sure I missed them if, if they exist because I haven't seen them. There's an OG ball. What about that doll? Could that be something? So they abuse children here in this uh, school too. That's not surprising. Can you like get off of the thing? So we're getting to the plot now. I'm gonna go ahead and, and guess that this entire game is is like I 
orphan crushing machine. I don't, I don't know. I mean, it, it was similar to the the first game. I'm sure. Which I still don't understand. Um, they were eating kids, I guess. They were feeding people to the guests. Oh, Jesus. This just got home alone. School run by Kevin McAllister? What the fuck? Yeah, I see you, kid. I can't see my own character. <laughs> okay, seriously, though. Pick it up. Pick it up. There you go. I gotta, like, throw this ball to this kid or something. rescued you from that hunter for a reason. Lord. What was this thing back here? Oh, it's one of those monkeys. At least it doesn't automatically make noise this time. I mean, that was the point before to distract the uh, crazy ass janitor guy. Good lord. At least the, uh, the controls responded in time. If these kids are so good at like defending the school, why is there at least one adult here? Because I saw them already. Not even in the video, but in the game. Son of a bitch, they trap. <laughs> I guess that's what's supposed to happen. Is
Sorry, buddy. This must be done. Dick. <laughs> Who's next? this little frog thing he was playing with? It's, I'm sure that's a real toy, or it was at some point. I need to be under the desk. I need to get out of this room because I don't want to hear any any chalk chalkboard screeching of any kind. she even putting on the board? Looks like a bunch of nonsense. We all see nothing, nothing, nothing. Shit, I'm gonna die. Okay, good. Nope, I'm dead. No! <laughs> or was that supposed to happen? Nope, it doesn't look like it. Is there a way to get this key without killing yourself? Perhaps you have to hide in this thing? Oh. 
long neck bitch. <laughs> Fight me, you long neck bitch. If you don't know what I'm talking about, it's when this the dumbass dinosaur meme. <laughs> Can I... Again, I, I don't know if it's audible in the background, but that clicking sound is the motor on my controller, I guess, being fucked up. Which is weird, because I I literally never use this controller, and it just sits there all the time, so I don't know how it can be broken. They're gonna... What's she doing? That's psychopath teacher. Oh, so this school thought it was abandoned. I guess it's just creepy. Hey, it's a gnome, finally. Or is that a kid that's gonna kill me? It's the, it was uh, the water. He looked like a gnome. They did that on purpose to trick people into, into dying. Whatever. Oh, I'll give you a point for that. Aha, very clever. Maybe you have to kill gnomes in this game? I don't know.
something I can hit this motherfucker with. Come at me, bro. Come at me, bro. <laughs> Little shit. See, as soon as you pick up the pipe, you're going to walk way slower, so like... Hitting him. Let me hit him again. Where do I rescue my friend at? That's a long neck, bitch. I didn't mean to do that. She she's beating a kid. It's like I fucking I really don't like these um, wooden platforming sections because you can't like you'll be like on the thing perfectly and it still decides to make you die. Like, I've fallen off so many times in the kitchen in the first game for no good reason. No, no, no. Okay. <laughs> you go in there. Okay. And it's not, it's not just the, like the wooden beams like this, but it's like everywhere in the first game. Anytime that there is a, uh, a platform you have to sneak across or even walk across like that long ass pipe to uh, get into the um, whatever in, in like chapter four. You would think it, it should be impossible to die from falling in a 2D platformer, like, just off of the normal-ass surface, but you would be wrong. Because it's, I mean, it's, it's like a, you know, 2.5D, really. 3D, really. Just side-scrolling. Library. This doesn't... Good. 
I was kind of hoping there would be more city stuff. Run, motherfucker! Okay, so we're repeating this library stuff from the first game. No, 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 no. Platforming controls in this game are very sluggish. It's not like, uh, I mean, even Uncharted, like, you know, the master of platforming still has these issues. Fucking shit! Go away, you bitch! Fucking long neck bitch! stay there. So I was doing it wrong. I wish I had actually watched a walkthrough. <laughs> I've literally only looked ahead like three seconds to find out what to do with that ball. I feel like they might be overusing the key mechanic in this uh, Spencer Mansion ass looking room here. Am I fucking blind? How am I losing track of the character this other shoes? He is it, whatever. I wish I could see my own character as well as the, the bosses can see me. <laughs> I'm over here trying to jump on the clock hands like it's broken as if there isn't glass. It's a big ass stamp. It's like the size of my character. Or it's a pepper shaker, I think. Or no, it's a pawn. A chess pawn. Okay, that's what that was what I thought originally. Uh put that back. What are you doing? Put put that back. I 
I guess you can't push it closer. Okay, whatever. How would you even break a, a rook like that? You'd have to try on purpose. Or any chess piece, really. I bet you there's some kind of achievement. Like... Win the chess game or something. Is that dude dead? I hope he's dead. throw something at that thing just yet. Why, why are they removing the tops of these chess pieces and using that kid as a, that kid's head with a crown on it as the king? That's fucked up. I think there's anything I can do here yet. isn't even a p oh yeah there is that's just a poorly drawn uh jock representation obviously i just don't know how to get the, the king piece or the queen i guess or the rook i don't play chess as you can tell or is that a bishop I forget what the pieces look like honestly i think the one i need is the bishop Um, also, what the f uh, How do I get there? Do I throw a bottle at it? I don't really feel like that's a good idea. I guess you have to. Good thing it doesn't break. <laughs> okay. Is it possible to go back and other piece? Using common sense. I wonder 
if I need this bottle, I'm gonna go grab it anyway. Why is there a dog pissing or whatever it's whatever's happening? Um, I'm happy that you can fall like a reasonable distance in this sequel without dying. In the first game, if you fell like an inch, you were basically dead. Anything over like a yard. What the fuck is going on in here? Not another kitchen. I hope these aren't the same chefs. Ah, balls. You asshole, come on. So you gotta you gotta think with your your brain. <laughs> the only way you could think. Aha, uh -huh, see, I'm one of you. Okay. Fuck you, buddy. Get the fuck off of me. <laughs> Come back here with this ladle and beat you all to death. All 30,000 of you. Fantastic, there's more of them. Fuck these kids, get... School's horrible. Are you gonna fall on top of me? Uh, but like, where do I actually go now? Okay. Oh, there goes my disguise. I'd rather deal with the long neck bitch than these kids. That'd be a better way to do this, like a wider thing to throw. I, I missed uh, one of those little specters. No, that is also glass. Oh, 
Why is everything glass here? Well, I guess it is like the 50s. Plastics weren't really <laughs> a big thing back then. Awkward ass fucking oh great now I'm stuck. <laughs> it's fucking lamp and it's bullshit is in the way. Oh, I'll just die, it's fine. Jar. What am I? What's my goal here exactly? I guess the brain is what I needed to throw. Uh, will this hook take me down, or will I just die again? Sweet. Where's that brain at? It's fucking gross. Oh no. Are those vegetables of some sort? liquor from Resident Evil. The, the real Resident Evil, not the remix. The ones in the in the remake have uh, like a different sound <laughs> to put it eloquently. Can you just go through the, the squeeze of the door? Come on, dude. So th this is what blocks my progress, is not being able to open a door. What? What just even happened?
Nah, I mean, it's fine. I, I guess it's fine. Um, I just, I fucking hate how the enemies pause before they're about to launch at you. Just gotta get good. That's all. Uh, solution to most things. Fuck! Fuckity fuck fuck fuck. Okay. Turn around, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> uh, on this note, I, I shit you not, uh, there is a co-worker, not really a co-worker, there's an employee in our company. Oh, fuck you. Fuck you so much. There's a guy that works at our company. His name is Hammer Killings. Like, literally, that is his name. So, how am I gonna kill these two assholes? They're right next to each other. <laughs> Fucking assholes. Literally infuriating. You, carry the hammer around with you. Let's get the fuck out of here. I think the level is, is like, safe from here. I don't know. Probably have to kill that long neck teacher. Hey, is there a, a piano achievement in this one? So you can do this part. Guess we go down.
She's a bro. This one on a rope? <laughs> These games are so like incredibly violent and, and shit. There has to be a reason for this hammer. going to be long neck up here playing the piano. What song is this? Blue Danube or something? I don't know. I'm not a classical expert. I'm really not an expert in, in anything, I guess. things. Why'd you stop? Can you help me? Oh man, I didn't even notice until now. They got that industry standard, uh, you know, white paint on the... <laughs> on the wedges to indicate where you can do things. It's fine, I'll let it go. It just seems to have become like a, a mandatory game design thing um, where maybe it shouldn't necessarily have a
What? You goddamn mo <laughs> Fucking hate technology. This is <laughs> Good lord, dude. So, how do we kill her? Why is her neck 18,000 feet long? Here's one of the segments I was talking about where I'm probably going to fall off the thing. Because the camera zooms out and you can't tell anymore, like, if you're moving straight. Shit. Hey, it's a banana peel or something, or a raincoat, I don't know. It is a raincoat. Haha, <laughs> alright. The colors.
I think uh, compared to the original, this is like way less stressful. Um, for a multitude of reasons, like the fact that you can actually hold keys in your pocket instead of having to hold the buttons down the whole time to carry them. Okay, so that's chapter three, or chapter two. Uh, all right. Uh, we'll continue this at another time. Peace, everybody.